Damn. We're all we know is that we're in meltdown mode right here we go, now. Here we go. Ooh, that was intense. <laughs> Alright, show us your show us your best stuff. What you got, Tigger? One, two, three. Uh. Oh! <laughs> oh! One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh. Oh, come on. Uh. Tigger has made his way to the front of the group. I'm not texting and driving. I'm videoing and driving. What you yelling at? I need to know. What's your? <laughs> Is that? <laughs> We good? I got it, I'm getting off. We good? I'm so excited and I just can't hide it. Woo! Woo! You're all cowboyed up today. You ready to go? I brought them, I swear, I swear I couldn't drive in them. I brought them. They're in here. Can we just take a look at how she's looking at me right now? Oh, you're back. Because she's already like, don't come over here trying to mess with me. I think, I think she may be our new Regina. Hi, Barb. The, the, the beef your horse has with everything. Huh. Every single fence Stop. side, you can walk around and she's broke a piece of the fence. Come on. Why are you breaking fences over here? You're so rude. <laughs> he kicked the he kicked mud up on her and it freaked her out. <laughs> oh, poor Tucker. Okay, you two cut it out now. She is like she's, he's, she is. She's being a bad influence. He said I'm going with her. Y'all just leave us alone. The lady said no. She means no. I was going to blame it on Tigger, but he's mine now too, so it doesn't even matter. <laughs> it's just all the I'm going to have to replace all of Courtney's fencing before we go home. I don't want to use Barbie, he said. Until you ride him, he's like, dude, you got to slow down a little bit. Tigger, we can go as fast as you want when I'm on your back, buddy. She is definitely being a bad influence right now. Definitely. All right, you want to try again? All right, you want to try again? Okay. I'm going to come over here and... <laughs> We just have to stop you so Tigger will stop too. Tigger, Tigger, whoa, whoa. <laughs> he said, don't y'all call me old again. I'll show you what I can do. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, you fed her this morning. Big mistake. <laughs> I even thought about it too. Everybody's gonna be like, you should be able to catch them horses. You come right on out here and help me catch them. Do you want some pets yet? Whoa. I don't even have a rope. Why don't you just love me? I wouldn't take it personally. Whoa. Come on. Good girl. Good girl. Come on. She said, psych. Barbie. She said, thank God you got Tigger. You can love him instead of me now. Look, it's just a hand. It's just a hand. She's like, I'm, I'm feral. I don't know if you heard, but I don't have to lie. No, he needs to be brushed. I'm sorry. Come on, Tigger. Let's get you brushed out. No, because he's for you. She 
just like, wait, y'all are serious? It's for real this time? So we are tag teaming Tigger's grooming right now. Courtney is trying to comb some knots out of his hair. And we were talking about how I might have a problem keeping his mane under control. Courtney, so <laughs> show his big full mane over here. I don't know if mm. we can see it. I'm yeah, and it's just a little naughty right here, but it's it's. So Courtney, you he's said got some the best highlights. Try to try to gripe at you sometimes for braiding it. Yeah, and so they're I'll like, be you. Honest, I'm probably gonna braid it before I just deal with knots on knots on knots well, if every you day. You braid it every week. Everybody's like, it damages the hair, but like I know people that show horses that they braid their horses' hair. Yeah. And they like they rebraid them every week, and there's a certain way you do it and stuff like that. I'll send you videos. Hey. Some people say it damages their hair. Tigger. I think when you look at all this. For long periods of time and you don't comb them out. Yeah. So every week and a half they have That's to your hair out. coming off. That's yuck. So you want to make sure that we're not blocking his shoulder blades. So his shoulder blades right here. Okay. And the point of the saddle, you can literally feel it. It's right behind the shoulder blade. Okay. This is sitting right here. It's not going to hit his shoulder blade. I think when you get your saddle made, you're not going to want this. This is an odd feeling. Okay. So, so. Did you tell me I was going to need something to hold my, to hold my legs? Hold your legs? No, I said I had to shorten this because your legs are so Yeah, hard. but when we were talking about saddles that day, you said something about some kind of pad to hold my legs because they were little. I was making a joke. <laughs> I was talking about for like a little kid's saddle. I said, it was, it's like buddy stirrups. You know, like, I would be joke. offended, okay? I would be offended. But I've never been accused of being small enough to ride in a little kid's saddle, and I'm flattered. <laughs> I am. I, I think this saddle is honestly going to be too big for you. It's fine. It's okay. It's fine. It's all going to be fine. <laughs> Maria Laveau would have put her spell on him over there. Mm hmm. <sighs> I don't He's... know if he wants to rear up, fart. <laughs> Damn. We're all we know is that we're in meltdown mode right we now. Go, go. Ooh, that was intense. That, <laughs> That's what I was telling you he did yesterday. That was a big leap for a for oh, an old boy. man. Alright, show, show us your best stuff. What you got, Tigger? One, two, three, uh. Oh. <laughs> oh. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh. Oh, come on, uh. both at the same time. I want, I, I know, I, I want to be naughty, but I don't even know how. <laughs> yeah, he's not really sure how to handle himself. You'll see her later. You're, oh, oh, you're, oh. Oh, we go. oh, come on now. You're fine. Can I move over here? I was going to say. He said, I'm going to get untied from here. Just letting him stand and look. Letting him stand and learn that even though he's pulled out away from her. Look at his hair and it, all in his eyes. Even though he's away from her, he's still going to go back to her and he has to participate. I said, so you go ahead and tie me. Untie me. Uh. <laughs> I like he likes his he, he honestly looks like a toddler, like throwing a tantrum. Like his movements are so small and <laughs> still kind of cute. Look, I try to be a bad horse like Barbie, but I don't know how to do Poor it. Poor baby. So I, he's like, honey, how do you do this? Oh, I got my head stuck. It, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sweet and gentle. So, I'm going to let Courtney do the talking to y'all on this one. Because y'all will notice that Tigger has a bit in his mouth right now. And he typically rides bitless. bitless. Okay. So, tell us why, Courtney. Right now, he just wants to go back to Barbie. He's buddy sour, right? Very now. buddy sour. Uh, but I put, I put a grazing bit on him, which is a softer bit. I didn't want to put a snaffle bit on him. But he don't like the bit, so he's opening his mouth and doing all this. And yeah, and everything's like, he doesn't like the bit. You're right. He doesn't like the bit, but breeding is great for him. So when he's with Barbie, if he's pony Barbie, he's fine. But when we don't take Barbie with us, he's, he's a little bit more pushy to go back because he's buddy sour. He's yeah. Look, I, the way I'm doing this, it's less than the force that it takes to open a door. 
So what's really important for me today when I'm riding him is to practice having gentle hands. <laughs> Yeah. Because that's like, okay, I always explain it like this. If you're, ah, see how he wants to go back? Mm -hmm. And we're just going to turn him the opposite way and make him stand. Right. So, if you take a rope and you pull a rope super tight, right? Mm -hmm. I see a lot of people, they ride super tight. And, I, and sometimes I have to ride tighter than I want, but we work on it with the horses. But see, I can drop loose on him. Yeah. If you ride super tight and then you have all that slack out of that rope once you have to actually go and do something there's no slack to work with yeah so if you ride nice and soft and loose when we got to get down to it see all these little things that i have to do with him i can do them nicely and softly if if i had to do them harshly well he wouldn't be going home with you <sighs> and and we would be not we'd be taking it back to square one with him but yeah for today taker so my friend sweet. Sorry. Okay. Sorry, I was measuring. We had to take a measurement real quick. <laughs> but we're going to get ready. Hi, baby. I love you. I have long legs. No, but I said little legs like you had little tiny legs. Because I'm a child. Child like legs? Is what you said? That's what you said. <laughs> that, now, I want you to push your feet just a little bit forward, and then you're going to ask him to trot. Say, take a trot. So bring him up into the walk and then ask him, say, give him a little and say, take a trot. Take a trot. Take a trot. Give him a little nudge with your feet. He's not going to take off. He's getting there. <laughs> ask him a little more. Come on, trot. Come on, trot. <laughs> give him a nudge with your foot. I'm telling you, girl, ain't that something nice? Perfect for your back. It doesn't feel like he's trotting. Give him a nudge with your feet. Both feet at once. There you go. Good kicks. You're going to have to nudge him harder, Bree. He's not made of cotton candy. Come on. He's my old man, though. There we go. Keep your back steady. There you go. Squeeze with your thighs. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I love this. You're going to get rotten to these gated horses. I know. Courtney had to go check on some things. So Tigger and I are just hanging out. <laughs> Uh, we're not going back towards Barbie. We're not going to go back towards Barbie. We're going to go this way. We're going to go on a little walk while we wait on Courtney to go for a ride, okay? My stallion friends are over there, but they make eyes at your girl, so you don't want to talk to them, huh? Let's go back up here. Come on. Come, come. This is good grass. This is good, such good grass, huh? I gave you a beautiful little yellow flower for our ride. You don't care. Okie dokie. Yeah. Yep. Like, it sounds like we're just gonna run, but we're not. I'm like, let's go. Breaks into a walk. Now he's not gonna holler at Oh no, he will. Give him a second. He's uh, warming up his pipes. Yeah. He is having a great time. He says, not on video. But that whole live, he screamed. Ah, I was going to say, watch out for the carrots right there. Swing right around the cars again. Barbie's like, better you than me. Don't forget to push your heels down, toes to the sky. There you go. Elijah. <laughs> Oops. Oh, look. He's like, don't worry, Barbie. I'm coming back. All right. Nudge him forward. There you go. Oh, good job, Bree. He's like, I know if I'm good for my mom, then she'll she'll let me go back sooner. Because she's a softie. Are we good now past Barbie? <laughs> yeah, Elijah. He kind of wants to look. He's like, I don't know. But he's doing really good. He's got that. He likes Alana. That's uh, one of the horses. He can say, he says, he tries to say Denver and Alana. <laughs> we gotta go with Ashley. Come on, get it. <laughs> yeah. He tells her to get 
tell him to rot. There goes Mikey. Kick him up. There you go. You're not going to hurt him. Alana's just driving like a drunk driver right now. <laughs> Tigger has made his way to the front of the group. I'm not texting and driving. I'm videoing and driving. It's different. I'm just trying to document the best day ever. Going back to our parking spot where I got up by the barn. That's where we're heading. I love him so much and I cannot wait until he's home and I can ride every day. Even if that bareback, I've got a bareback pad and I'm excited for the time that we can just do this whenever we feel like it. No driving, just walk out, get my horse, go for a little ride. We are going to stop right here. Ready? What you yelling at? I need to know what you're... Is that... We good? We good? We good? No? Are we good? <laughs> Done? What are we, what are we talking about here? Are you ready to go back with, with Barbie? Whoa, whoa. Okay. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. We had lots of fun at horsey camp. I, don't you push on me. I know that Courtney has taught you personal space. She doesn't play about her personal space, okay? So I know you know better. Don't be pushing up on me, okay? Thank you. You can holler at me because I love to hear you talk. Whoa. Whoa. You're so handsome. Let me see your... Look at that flower. Whoa. Look at that flower hanging out of your mouth. Look at you. You're so sweet. Whoa. Look at me. I want to see that. Oh. What a handsome boy. <laughs> no. That's why I started recording so I didn't miss anything good again. Don't sniff the poop. Look at his flower cigarette in his mouth. He's a flower eating fool, man. There's definitely one in the couple that is more obsessed than the other. He is just excited to get back to his lady. Listen, he's going to start going crazy. You going to start going crazy? No, not today. You already got all your crazy out? Did you? No, not yet. Where are your ears? <laughs> you had to go on a ride.